Today we are going to learn how to make an attendance system using RFID and how to log the data in the Excel sheet. Before going into the topic, we need to understand some basics of how RFID will work. Basically, RFID always transmitting its radio frequency around it. So whenever we, are, we, we place the RFID tag in the radio frequency, it will get powered up and it will power its chip. And the chip contains of specific data which can be modified later. Now we are going to learn how to get the ID from its own tag. For that we have individual program and this is how you are going to connect, connect accordingly. In this program we specified how to get its own UID by using MFRC library. Before compiling the code, you have to install the library. For that, you have to go manage libraries and then you have to type the library name in this search column. And here I have already installed the library. What you have to do is choose the latest version and give install. After installing the library, you have to connect the Arduino and check it, it is correct or not. For that you have to choose Arduino you know and if you, if you will connect the port, the port will come. And now I have connected the Arduino and we can see the port and it is connected to COM10. Now I am going to compile it to check any error is there or not. If the error is not there, it, it will come done compiling. After that we have to upload it. And now it is uploaded successfully. And, and with me I have two RFIDs and uh, this is its corresponding UAD and one is and the second one is now you have to copy and paste this EFIDs in the next program and the next program is used for rewrite the instructions or data inside the chip of the corresponding RFID. For that we have to rewrite the UADs into specific data. In this instead of the EFID instead of the EFID I have I am going to update the names of the student present in the class and after that I am going to print the date student name and a section of him. Now we, we are going to upload it. After uploading you can check now if I show the corresponding EFID you can see the name of the student. I have replaced the EFID into name of the student and additionally I have added date, time and section within the comma. Why comma is we have to use it in Excel. You can easily convert comma separated files into XLS format. So now we uploaded the code into Arduino program. Arduino you know. So now you can you don't want this Arduino ID software. To update the data in Excel, we have to create an Excel file and and you have to check this data streamer is available in your Excel or not. If it is not available, you have to go to File, Options, and then Add-ins and then 
manage you have to choose com audience and you have to press ok connect a device yeah it is coming here now choose this and it is coming like this and if you press start data now it is expecting data from the arduino if i show the rf arduino means it will get updated 